Lisa, Blackpink, is criticized for not being worthy of Friday Ricano, is it outdated? In recent days, rumors about a romantic relationship between Lisa, Blackpink, and the scion of a billionaire family, Friday Ricano, have been of particular interest to the public and media worldwide. Although neither of them has confirmed the information, fans are hopeful that this couple could have a lasting and even blissful relationship because they seem so compatible. However, recently, the Chinese media outlet Sina made a controversial statement. It is known that this theory was compiled by Sina from the majority of opinions in the online community. According to this theory, the singer Lisa may find it difficult to become a daughter-in-law in the billionaire family of Frida Ricano. This source believes that the reason lies in the stark difference in social status between Lisa's family and the rumored boyfriend's family, as well as the truly unimaginable scale of Bernard Arnold's family. Nevertheless, when looking at the daughters-in-law of the family, the public still finds a bright spot for Lisa and Frida Rick's relationship. Frida Ricano was born in 1995, making him two years older than Lisa. He is the son of billionaire Bernard Arnault and his second wife the pianist Helen Mercier. The billionaire couple has three sons, with Frida Ricano being the middle child. Bernard Arnault is famously known as a tycoon of luxury goods and is the chairman of the luxury conglomerate LVMH, France. Bernard was once the richest person in the world but has since been surpassed by two other billionaires, currently holding the third position. It is known that LVMH is an empire in the luxury fashion distribution sector owning prestigious brands such as Louis Vuitton, Christian Dior, Celine, Fendi, Tiffany and & Company, and Vigari. Not only did Bernard Arnault succeed in building a powerful empire, but he also gained admiration for nurturing his five children into ambitious talents who excel academically and head major luxury companies. Among them, the eldest daughter, Delphine Arnault, holds multiple executive positions within the group, deputy CEO of LV. CEO of Dior. Antoine Arnaud, the eldest son, is often referred to as the prince of the luxury empire and holds the position of CEO of LVMH, Lauro Piana. The second son, Alexandre Arnaud, is fluent in three languages, English, French, and German. This young and talented individual led two luxury brands, Ramar and Tiffany and Company. The fourth child of the French billionaire is Jean Arnaud, born in 1998, who has the highest academic achievements in the family. It is known that the heiress has two master's degrees, one in mechanical engineering from the Royal College of London and one in finance from MIT. Currently, Jeanne holds the position of director of marketing development for LV's watch line. Lisa's fame, which extends worldwide, is undeniable. However, she comes from a relatively modest background. Lisa was born and raised in Beriram Province, Thailand. The singer's real name is Pranpradaya Manaban, later changed by her mother to Lalisa. Lisa's parents divorced when she was young, and her mother remarried the world-renowned chef Marco Brushwila. Instead of her biological father, her stepfather is more present in her life, always caring for Lisa. He is widely known as Master Chef Marco. Lisa's stepfather is from Switzerland and is a renowned world-class chef. He is also a culinary business advisor, Thai cuisine expert, and has created numerous special dishes. He has even been awarded the title of Global Master Chef by the World Association of Chefs Societies. Marco Brushwiller graduated from the Swiss Hotel Management School, a renowned institution in the hotel industry, and was quickly hired as a chef at the Sun City Casino in South Africa. A few years later, he returned to Bangkok and served in various luxury hotels as a professional chef. Lisa represents a range of top luxury brands. Not only is she talented in music, but her valuable image, commercial value, and marketing acumen have made her a sought-after choice for these luxury brands. Moreover, Lisa is also a fashion influencer, which is a logical connection between her and her rumored boyfriend's family as the LVMH empire is the most powerful fashion conglomerate in Europe and one of the top worldwide. Some opinions also suggest that Lisa, as an Asian, would be an exception if she were to join her boyfriend's family. Additionally, cultural differences are not an issue between Lisa and Frida Ricano. Thanks to her Thai mother and Swiss father, Lisa is familiar with both Asian and European cultures from a young age, 
making it easy for her and Frederick to get along. Currently, their relationship continues to be of special interest to many. The world of celebrity romance is always captivating, and the recent rumors surrounding Lisa from the famous K-pop group Blackpink and Frederick Arno, the scion of a billionaire family, have taken the global media by storm. Despite no official confirmation from the two individuals, the speculation surrounding their potential relationship has ignited debates and discussions among fans and observers alike. Lisa, whose real name is Lala Samanaban, has achieved worldwide fame as a member of Blackpink, one of the most successful and influential K-pop girl groups. Her stunning visuals, exceptional talents, and international appeal have earned her a dedicated fan base spanning across continents. On the other side of the equation, Frede Ricano hails from a family of exceptional wealth and prominence, with his father Bernardano being a prominent figure in the luxury goods industry. The alleged romantic connection between Lisa and Frederick has sparked curiosity due to the stark contrast in their backgrounds. While Lisa comes from a more modest family, Frederick is the son of a billionaire tycoon. This disparity in social status has led some to question whether their relationship can withstand the challenges that may arise from such differences. However, modern relationships have proven time and again that genuine connections can transcend societal norms and expectations. Frede Arnold's family holds a distinguished position in the world of luxury fashion. The LVMH conglomerate, headed by his father Bernard Arnault, boasts a portfolio of renowned brands including Louis Vuitton, Christian Dior, and Fendi, among others. This luxury empire is not only synonymous with opulence but also with a legacy of innovation and excellence in design. Lisa's involvement with high-end fashion brands further adds to the intrigue surrounding their rumored relationship, as it seemingly aligns with Frederick's family background. Cultural considerations are also in focus when exploring the potential union of these two individuals. Lisa's unique background, with a Swiss stepfather and Thai mother, has exposed her to a blend of Eastern and Western cultures from a young age. This multicultural upbringing could potentially bridge the cultural gap that often exists in relationships between individuals from different parts of the world. Frederick's own exposure to various cultures due to his family's global endeavors could also contribute to mutual understanding and compatibility. One key fact that observers point to is Lisa's global success and her ability to seamlessly transition between different cultures. As a beloved K-pop idol, Lisa has amassed a massive following not only in Asia but also in Europe, North America, and beyond. This international recognition showcases her ability to connect with people from diverse backgrounds, which could serve as a valuable asset in any cross-cultural relationship. As speculation continues to swirl, it's important to remember that celebrities are also individuals with their own feelings, desires, and choices. While the media and fans are invested in their personal lives, the ultimate decisions about their relationships rest solely with Lisa and Frederick. The public's fascination with their rumored romance is a testament to the power of celebrity culture to capture our imaginations and evoke discussions about love, compatibility, and societal expectations. In the end, whether Lisa and Frederick's relationship evolves into a lasting partnership or remains a rumored connection, their story serves as a reminder that love knows no bounds and that a heart often follows its own unique path. In a world filled with uncertainties, their alleged romance sparks hope and curiosity, reminding us of the universal desire for connection and companionship, regardless of social status or cultural background.